Okay, my name is Jen Shade, and this is a 2006 Road King. Uh, it used to be uh, a yellow and black uh, that only Steeler fans really enjoyed uh, and complimented on. And then we got a hold of it and uh, changed things around just a little bit. My problem was when I went to go look for bikes, Unfortunately, when you walk into a sh most showroom floors, you see, for women in particular, if there's a color you're looking for, there's purple, there's pink, maybe some different colors, blue, but I, there really wasn't anything that I was interested in. But fortunately enough, my better half, um, he uh, reminded me that anything can be done. And he said, don't look at it for the color, look at it for the bike, look at it, uh, look at it for what the possibility is. The biggest thing was primarily thinking about how I could make it something that was mine instead of just buying something off the floor. I would kind of learn that it's really about your imagination and not doesn't always have to be about your wallet because some of the paint jobs get pretty pricey. And to be totally honest with you, this is Krylon. So I can touch up the bike when necessary and also touch up my patio furniture, uh, which we actually shot um, all of the parts at the house on um, a bunny hutch because we didn't have any paint stands. So I thought I really liked uh, a pearlesque kind of thing. So that's the color of Krylon I picked. We shot it out. Some friends of mine that uh, are in New Oxford, Pennsylvania, Cliff and Skip, are such fantastic artists. I walked into their shop. I said, here are the colors that I want on my striping. I don't want it girly curly and I don't want it masculine. And once I saw their work, I realized I didn't have to say anything to them other than I'll be back tomorrow and this is what they came up with and I was thrilled. Then I went ahead and the guys make fun of me because I've bedazzled a little bit of it but that wasn't because I wanted to put rhinestones on a bike as much as it was that I have a lot of chrome and the flat with the chrome kind of was a disconnect. So I used some of those stones to kind of bring that together. It was a little bit more intelligent than just wanting to bedazzle the bike like a purse. So <laughs> that's kind of where that got started. And then we started, uh, I know obviously got the bags, um, my nest bags, um, Gator Bob for the lids, which again, being a female, that means I can fit even more shoes and accessories in each bag and don't have to ask the guys to carry anything. And uh, nest on the front end, um, and just started putting the pieces together from there.